best believe she's still bejeweled. Taylor Swift rocked an opal ring surrounded by blue stones while celebrating her 34th birthday on Wednesday, and fans are speculating that Travis Kelsey gifted her the massive bauble. Miles Teller's wife, Kelly Sperry, fueled the viral rumor by liking a TikTok video breaking down the theory. In the Saturday upload, user at Swiftian KC asked her followers for help identifying the jewelry present in Swift's Instagram party pics on the middle finger of her right hand. Blue topaz is one of the birthstones for December, and opal is one of the birthstones for October, the fan explained, pointing out that Swift and Kelsey's birthdays are in those months. The Swifty went on to share a photo of Swift out with Sperry, 31, and Teller, 36, as she seemingly showed the couple the ring. This to me is giving gift, the social media user said. It's giving, look what he got me. It's giving, look how beautiful this custom piece is. Elsewhere in the footage, she mentioned that Sperry and Teller are the rumored matchmakers who played Cupid and set up Swift and the NFL player, as mentioned in Kelsey's Wall Street Journal. Magazine profile last month. Swift's rep has yet to respond to page 6 request for comment. TikTok users sounded off on the theory in the comments, with many believing that the, the Sapphire and Moonstone stones are references to Swift's 2022 song Bejeweled. One follower noted, wherever it came from, asterisk cough asterisk, a natural opal of that size is no joke. No mistake, that is a major piece of jewelry. Swift and Kelsey, both 34, have been dating since sometime this summer, hard launching their romance in September. While the tight end did not attend his partner's New York City birthday bash, as he had prior football commitments, Swift promptly returned to his side to watch his team beat the New England Patriots in Massachusetts over the weekend. The Grammy winner's dad, Scott Swift, sat in the stands with her amid rumors Kelsey asked for the 71-year-old's blessing for Taylor's hand in marriage, which, page six hears, Scott, wholeheartedly, gave.